Hi guys and welcome to Moonfox Models. Today I'm gonna unbox the Schleich Horse Club Hannah's Guest Horses with Ruby the Dog. And this contains this lovely Appaloosa mare and foal as well as of course Ruby. And let's turn this around. Here is a list of everything included in this playset, and I'm really excited to take a closer look at the doghouse. The pictures here show some of the features, and down here we have the other horse club girls showing off playsets from the horse club line. So I've been waiting forever to open this, so let's do it. First out, the blanket, the halter, and the pretty foal. Oh, some things for the doghouse. A tiny, tiny bird. Ruby's dog bowl. Accessories for the paddock. The fencing for the paddock. And these are parts for the gate. Oh, here is the mare. Here's the little booklet that Schleich sends with most of their play sets. And this just contains some of the play sets and Schleich products. Here is a part of the doghouse. Another part of the doghouse. Finally, Ruby the dog. The last part of the doghouse and last but not least come on the instructions on how to put everything together as well as the stickers for the archway to the gate there was everything in the box is empty now I'm going to go ahead and remove everything from the plastic packaging and then I'll be back. I'm back and as you can see I got everything out of the packaging. I went ahead and put the doghouse together. And look at all the cool stuff we're getting. I'm so excited to show you the details. In this set we got four pieces of this white fencing. And this is the standard horse club uh, Schleich fencing and compatible with most other fencing of this type. It's very detailed and has wood grain texture. And with the fencing we got this beautiful gate and archway. I went ahead and put the stickers on and it looks the same from both angles. The gates have a latch that allows it to lock in place to keep horses from escaping. And these two have amazing details with the wood grain texture. Yeah, that's really cool. This dog house was really easy to put together. The roof comes off and it is hollow through it has this storage unit on the side it opens up and this was really easy to put together it just clicks in place and you just put the roof on this is a really cute little window like that and it has this ring to tie up your dog this too has this lovely wood texture. It looks like it's built out of wood. 
of these wooden planks. And you can put everything you need for your dog in this storage area. And if we have a dog house, we also need some accessories for the dog, of course. So we have this lovely little bone. And Ruby the dog can actually hold this in her mouth. I'll show you that in a bit. She also has this stick. She can hold this too in her mouth. You've got this really cute little mustard yellow bowl with paw prints and bones decorating the sides. And the bone fit really well in this. And here we have the little dog color. It's a really pretty red with white dots. And this um, side here is elastic. So you can put it on pretty much any dog. This is the halter. It has a lovely red color. And it's one of Schleich's standard chain halters and they are adjustable so they fit a number of different sized horses. I just love the red color of the lead rope. So this is really pretty. And this is a full sized halter so this will fit the mare perfectly. Here is the little foal blanket. It's, it looked more pinkish on the box but it's actually a lovely red color and this pattern and colors matches Hannah from Horse Club and it also matches a blanket that was sold separately for Hannah and Cayenne so that's a really neat detail it ties in well with the Horse Club and this has this button fastening so you just click it shut like that and the fabric is very thin, so I feel like uh, it will wear out around the bottom really quickly, unless you're careful with it. But I just love that little fold blanket. For some extra decoration of our paddock, we have this really cute little box tree. And this is just, it's really easy to put together. And it's really cute. It really adds details to any setting. And I love the little pot with the horses, the heart shape. So I think this is really cute. This is Ruby the dog. Just look at that little face. She's so cute. I did some snooping around on the Schleich website and she is a border collie really pretty border collie and at first I did not like her pose at all because I thought it looked like she was like crouched down and she was really long but in real life she looks a lot better I must say she's a very detailed dog and her mouth is open to allow us to just pop the bone in so she easily carries the bone you don't have to use any force to make her bite down on it or anything and she also can carry the stick because I'm sure she loves playing fetch I know when I was a child we had a border collie and he loved playing fetch so I think she's a really pretty model Last but not least, we have the stars of the show, the Marin Foal. I just love their colors, I'm not gonna lie. The foal is just adorable. I'm pretty sure it's a filly. I love her face marking and her color. She has decent shading and I love this little sock or stocking. I'm not sure of the correct term for English markings 
This is an adorable mold and she's an exclusive version of um, a standalone Appaloosa Philly that you can buy in stores or you could, I'm not sure if they're retired now. But she's really cute. Also look at these little feet. And here we have the mare. I actually love this pose, but I'm not sure if it's supposed to be a running pose or a standing pose or if she's just stretching. But I love her markings. And I had no idea before I got this set that Appaloosas could be solid colored. I thought you had to have this little blanket of spots on their behind. And in some cases they can be solid colored and this mare is a lovely chestnut. I just love her markings and I, I have a weakness for chestnut in general. This mare is also an exclusive version of the mold that you can buy um, as a single in stores. I just want to bring your attention to her hooves because she has these uh, vertical stripes on her hooves. These, it's easy to, like, to see here, these vertical lines. And Schleich usually make horizontal lines, so they go across. And these vertical lines are actually a trait of the Appaloosa breed. So I thought that it was really cool of Schleich to include that because I had no idea before I got this set and I did some research. These also have a little bit of white paint on her ear, but I just consider that a cute marking. That was my review of the Schleich Horse Club Hannah's Guest Horses with Ruby the Dog playset. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I want to say a special thank you to all my subscribers. It means the world to me to see that you enjoy my videos. Thank you everyone who comments and likes on my videos. It means a lot and it really motivates me to keep going. It's you who make the channel, so to speak. So thank you so much. I hope to see you in the future. And if you like this, feel free to comment, subscribe or give it a like. Thank you so much again. Bye.